Hello, my name is Airdas Kirstukas, and in this tutorial I will show you how to set up breadcrumb in the Astra team. Astra lets you add breadcrumbs, and not just that, you can add stylish breadcrumbs by managing the colors and typography to suit your website team. Breadcrumbs are a way to let users know where we are on the website and make back navigation easy for them. Breadcrumbs on the website also let search engines understand a website hierarchy. Let's jump on our website and do it. If we're gonna go on the website, we need to go on customizer, breadcrumb section, and then we have the options, none. So that's no breadcrumbs gonna be displayed at all. If we pick inside the header, gonna be shown inside the header. If we pick after header, it's gonna be after header. And third option before the title. You can see three option. And then you have breadcrumb source. You can default so that Astra team. And then if you're using any plugin breadcrumbs nav or rank math or CEO, you can pick one of them. Just gonna leave one of default at the moment. You can have separator design, you can swap it if you want. And then you all have option disable on homepage, disable on blog post, disable on search, disable on archive, disable on single page. I prefer to pick disable on page. I want just show them on the post. And then next section is alignment. So you can pick left, you center and you can pick right. Let's put center. And then you can as well adjust the spacing how you want. You can go to them. You can't go to the minus, just zero, zero colors. If you're gonna press on a color widget, you go and you can select the color. Let's say select some other color, pink that we could see. Yeah. And if we hover, we can select as well kind of other color if you want you can pick this one green yep and typography as well if you pick on the content you can pick whatever you want and it will change size you can adjust the size weight normal inherit it works with some family it, with some family don't work Capitalize, it's capitalized or uppercase or lowercase, it's down to your preference. And line high, so you can make more or less spaces. That's the setting you can use in Astra Free Team. If you want to display the breadcrumbs anywhere on a page, you can actually display, as you can see in this example, just put Astra breadcrumb anywhere on your blog post and would display the breadcrumb like this. But for this option, you need a pro version. So if you need that kind of option, you can buy and use it. I'm gonna press the publish, exit to the dashboard. And if you're gonna go, just gonna show a few things about the plugins. If you install that plugin like breadcrumb nav XT, you need to go to the setting to breadcrumb nav XT. And then if you pick on the Astra team to display there, it's gonna show the properties of this plugin setup. It's so many options, it is available here. It's really you can make to display whatever you want and how do you want. But in most cases, default setting is good enough. And then as well rank math. If you're using this plugin for your COO, you as well go on general setting and you can use breadcrumbs from this plugin as well. You can set separator show the link and few other options it's not not many options it's most of them it's coming 
default team setting, but if for CEO you're using this plugin, then it makes more sense to use breadcrumbs from here. If you want to display the breadcrumb from CEO Yoast, you need to go on the CEO and then on the search appearance and you have the section breadcrumbs. And then you have a setting separator between the crumbs, answer text, prefix for the breadcrumb path and other settings. And then taxonomy, how to show in breadcrumbs for your contents. You can pick which one option you want. You have few settings there and, and then you need to press save changes. Go to the, your website on a customizer on the breadcrumbs and pick your CEO breadcrumbs and would be displayed from that plugins. If we're gonna press on news and the package consolidation, you will see, it doesn't see any different from the previous display, but just all the information which displayed and which taken is from that YoCO plugin. So that helped for the website to get better indexing. I am Airdas Kirstukas. Thanks for watching this. If you enjoyed this content, feel free to subscribe below and press notification bell. As if you will watch my videos, it will help you to create amazing websites.